Bro, we're going to get into this. We're going to keep this all the way funky. I'm going to keep this a band. I'm going to say my case. Okay. And I'm going to just leave it alone after that. Yo, 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 yo. What's up? What's happening? What's going on? It's your boy, Chain Wang. Welcome to the blog. Y'all know what to do. Like, share, subscribe, and hit that bell so you can be notified when I drop these videos. All right, so I just watched a little snippet of the uh, Say Cheese interview with Mama Duck. And, you know, she's still, you know, as she should as a mother, you know, she's still mourning over the loss of her son, even though it's been over a year. It's going to take time for her to heal. She might never heal from that. Like, I lost my brother. You know what I'm saying? So I know that type of pain, even though it wasn't my child or nothing. I know how it feels to lose somebody that's close to you. But um, we ain't going to talk about all that. But let's get into it. So basically, she's doing an interview, and she's saying that she feels as though if they did what they were supposed to do as far as the paramedics-wise and all that, police doing the, the call to call the ambulance up there, that duck, I ain't, we ain't going to say that he would have made it. He could have survived. Because if you sitting there telling me that this man was at the golf, what's at the golf course, and it's three minutes away from the hospital, and this man was on the ground fighting for his life for 17 minutes, that just don't add up to me. And then it was more so like the police, they out there. I mean, you know, they're going to do that job to everybody to back away from the crime, but it's just like from the video that I saw, it was everybody else saw, it wasn't like they was really trying to like help that man, tend to that man. I'm not gonna say that they didn't care, but they could have acted a lot quicker on that scenario than what they did. And then it was just like, you know, when the, when the paramedics did get there, you know, they taking that sweet time, they having conversations. Like, I'm not gonna sit there and say that they just let that man go, but I do feel like it's bigger than what we saying. Like, okay, yeah, we know the OTF members did that, but by Duck being such of a big name, a lot of people did not care for Duck off of, you know, how that the internet, the media portrays somebody. You get what I'm saying? They try to make you seem like you this dame and this person, whoop -de -whoop -de -whoop, whatever the case may be, if that is the case, whatever. But when scenarios go down like that, like anybody deserves to have that life spared if it can be. Whether you are a killer, a good person, a bad person, a cop, whatever the case may be. If you shot and you wounded and you fighting for your life, people should tend to help you no matter what. Because nobody really deserves to lose their life. It just happens. You know what I'm saying? Natural cause, gun violence. You know what I'm saying? Stuff like that. And it just goes to show you off of scenarios like this, it might be deeper than what we think. So you got to look at it like that too. And then I'm also hearing like, even though I'm just jumping out there just saying stuff like, the mayor didn't even like FBG Duck. You know, like, why you say that? It just, it just goes like politics, government, police, all them people, they work together. Like, you get what I'm saying? This man fighting for his life. And his mother said the last words that he said, like, I'm shot. Y'all not going to help me. You know what I'm saying? I, I don't know. Certain scenarios, certain situations that... It could have it could have been helped, but in this case, we don't know what would have happened if they would have got there quicker or attended to him. She's just a mother stressing how she feels. She got every right to do that. So um, like I said, I ain't gonna go. I'm never going to no rant no more. I'm gonna start doing lives. Like I'm getting ready to turn up on y'all too. But y'all, let me know what y'all think about that though, bro. Cause she do make some valid points, but none of us was there. We was just watching for one. Then a scenario, like, I don't know, like, the police might have reported it, said the man got shot, I think he got shot, like, 22 times, they might have said that, they probably, like, he gonna die, anyway. you get what I'm saying, I can't say, I don't know, it don't matter, I'm not sitting there trying to, you know, justify the case, I'm just, you know, you gotta say all scenarios, but his mother know more than anybody know, LAPD know more, they already had the, the NASA cameras out, so people know more than what we know, but... Y'all let me know what y'all think about that, though, bro. Like, you think she made a valid point? You think they could have helped him possibly survive if they would have attended it or got there quicker? I mean, 22 times being shot, I mean, you don't know what it, you don't know what type of complications or what it's going to have to you, even if you was to survive. But uh, y'all let me know what y'all think, and I'm out.